tomorrow. My name is Laird Hood. They call me Arrow. Now, for as long as I can remember, I've been a slave in Pedware, and I finally just got the opportunity to really make something of myself, be my own man. Now, there's not really a lot of options for a slave like me. Really, all I could do is become a pirate. But if I work really hard, I could even become a pirate captain. Have my own ship. The best of the best schools of piracy in the world is Weaponry Academy, so that's where I headed. But I don't really need to be telling you all this. I mean, it's all there in Chapter 1. You've read it. You haven't? Ah, oh, that's right. It's not in print yet. Well, there's something we can do about that. Come with me. Now, this is what it looks like now. And I can vouch that everything that we see in here is true. The author has been very accurate in portraying our lives and what happens to us. But there's a lot more that needs to be done in order for it to be printed. I mean, there's all sorts of bonus material that's been going in there, illustrations, backstories about us, a uh, backstory comic, actually, about Target and Trebuchet. This is an extra 16 pages alone. Now, between all of it, it's going to be about 85 pages altogether, and there's lots of stuff in there that won't be shown anywhere else. Now, there's lots that you can do to help out. I mean, obviously, the gold is the big issue. And originally we had thought of getting shrapnel to come in to your houses in the middle of the night, rape all of your small household animals, beat you to a bloody pulp, and, and steal your gold. But in the long run, it didn't really sound like a good plan, especially not if you want you to like us. So instead, they've decided to ask me to ask my best pet wearing, please, please help us. Give us your money. Give us your gold. Because that, without that, it really can't happen. Now, there's other ways that you can help out, but there are some really fantastic incentives that are going to be offered if you do decide to pitch in your money to help this happen. There's going to be illustrations, prints of myself in rather risque criteria, as well as these fantastic little keychains, lovely hatcha. And there's also going to be uh, signed copies of the book, there's going to be illustrations in some of them, depending on how much you pledge, cosplay made by the author herself. Lots of things, so think about putting in whatever you can, every little bit helps. And if not, do spread the word. Put it up on your Facebook, on your, your social media, your DeviantArt, however you can to let as many people know as possible in order to get the funds together in order to do this. Now, I have asked my very nicest. I've done my best. But if that doesn't work, there's always Shrapnel's methods. I'm Astra Crompton. I am the writer and creator of Weaponry. It is a web comic that updates every Monday online, and it is a yaoi or boys love story about pirates who are trying to become pirate captains. It is an interactive story, so I ask your input as readers to comment on the pages and let me know uh, what you think, what you'd like to see, and at the end of every chapter you get the option of how you would like to see the story proceed. So there are three main characters. There's Arrow, Blade, and Gun. And we have just finished our first chapter online, and I am getting in the poll results now of what you would like to see happen for chapter two. In the meantime, I am trying to get chapter one to go to print. So I am doing a fundraiser on Indiegogo, which is to try and raise the funds through my readers and hopefully other uh, supporters of the arts and comics to try and get together the grand total to do a first printing. So the grand total is $1,950, which is low on the comic spectrum of printing, but I'm hoping that it will be enough to get things going for chapter one to be in our hot little hands. So for it, I have put together not only the 38 pages of the comic that was published online, but also and a bunch of extras that I put together. So I've got some illustrations, crossbones, which is what could have happened if the vote had gone another way, the vote result, and also a backstory of Target and Trebuchet, which is an extra 16 pages. Altogether, it comes to 85 pages in the print volume, and there are a lot of exclusives that will not be published online, so it's hopefully going to encourage people to get a copy in hard for themselves to, to keep on their shelves. And I am doing a lot of incentives to try and encourage people to donate, so I've got things like prints that will come with the print copy of the book. I'll be doing signed copies as well as illustrations on the inside cover. I am offering things like your name in the credits, keychains, handmade plushies of the characters, and the grand prize is a cosplay of any character from Weaponry done to your measurements, sewn by yours truly, so hopefully that's an exciting option for you there. 
Um, and I also have uh, a lot of other things that will be going into it as we're doing the fundraiser. So hopefully if we meet the totals, I've got secret backgrounds that I'm working on for, uh, for people's desktops that I'll be releasing. And I'll be doing up some cosplay photos with uh, one of our readers who has graciously agreed to do a Target cosplay. So I'm hoping to have a lot of other bonus stuff. So please do come along for the ride. If you are not able to donate, then there are other ways you can help out. Please share it on your Facebook, your DeviantArt, your social media, uh, send it to your friends. Uh, hopefully you know people who would also enjoy a story like this. And we can get it out to as many people as possible and hopefully get everyone together and make this dream happen. So please do do whatever you can. If you haven't read it yet, if you don't know what weaponry is, do check it out. It's on the website uh, at otherworldscomics.com. It's also available on Smack Jeeves and on DeviantArt. So if you use any of those, please do check it out. Uh, it's a lot of fun. We've had a lot of great feedback so far. And hopefully you will join us for the ride. So weigh anchor and set sail. And hopefully we'll see you in Chapter 2. Thank you.